D and D is hard. Now let me stop you before you start saying D and D is amazing. It's so much fun. Why would you say that it's hard? Hear me out because it is. Let me start by saying that I'm a huge lover of D and D and tabletop role playing games in general. But when I was first starting, it was so confusing. The only things I knew about it was that it was a bunch of people who sat around a table with mountains of books and papers and dice and little printed miniatures and somehow it was all great fun. It looks cool, I got to put my heart and soul into characters, and the dice bring out my inner goblin, <laughs> but it was hard to get a grasp on everything that goes into it. But eventually I did, and I went from a player who barely knew anything to a GM who still has to look up spells and lore. And there's nothing wrong with that, but let's get into the meat of why I'm making this video. I've spent years in the TTRPG community, and the one thing I've heard a chorus of is this comment, I don't know where to start, which is usually followed by a number of different reasonings, but the one thing I picked up on was that it's a lot, and my friends and I don't know how to play, and no one wants to be the GM. And there's a lot of resources out there for people who want to start or learn more, and I absolutely encourage you to do that. But I decided to create a TTRPG that covers the things that I was looking for as a baby TTRPG player, and as things that I and my players enjoy at my own tables. The last is designed for people who want a simple introduction into the mechanics of tabletop role-playing games. And if you don't have many friends, this game can be played with two people. The rules of this world are modular meaning you can use as many or as little of the rules as you want. If you aren't fond of combat or rules and just want to roleplay a scenario, toss out the book. Just read along in the scenario guide and go with what you think the story should be. For the baby GMs who worry about world building and sounding straight out of a novel, you can just read from the scenario guide. Guide notes will help assist you in building your own world and helping you find your flow. But don't forget you're not alone. The players are also telling the story, so work together and be flexible about your stories. And if you like the rules but hate the pre-run scenario, toss it and try homebrewing your own game or apply it to anything else you enjoy, as long as you're having fun and exploring what makes you happy. If you're stuck on where to begin with TTRPGs, check out the description for a link to the last guidebook and the last gas station scenario. If you're like me and you're not fond of reading long chunks of text, an audiobook version is included. And hey, there's a free edition too if you can't or don't want to shell out the cash. Happy playing, my friends. On a scenic road path down 66, you and your friends are catching the path of a lifetime.